uh, a, a room, why don't you go? Talking and happily, and not very quietly to herself. Eliza got down on her knees and started to pick up the flowers. One of the food sellers got down next to her and said quietly, Be careful. There's a man over there who's writing down every word you say. Maybe he's detective. Some of the people near them heard this and turned to look at the man standing on the outside, the outside of the town. He was busy writing in a small book, and he did not look up Eliza. Eliza was frightened. Hey, I haven't done it, anything wrong, speaking to the gentleman about my flowers. Have I? I'm a nice girl. I only want wanted him to pay for my father's need, and she started to cry. Oh, what's going on? Do you know what's going on here? She's, she, she tried to bully Freddie. Freddie is the one who just came. Oops, knocked everything on the floor. She got angry. Her mother, Freddie's mother, snubbed her. And now the crowd around her says, oh, look at this guy. He's writing everything down, and he might be a detective. And the girl then gets frightened. Because why? Because she's nothing. She's a little gutter snipe. She's a little person of the street. She sells flowers for just pennies to get by. She's not rich. She has no, she has no fine clothes. She has dirty clothes on her. She's afraid she's going to get into trouble. And she says, I've done nothing wrong. You can't, you can't, don't arrest me. Uh -huh. And who is this person? He's just taking notes. We don't know who he is. <laughs> I didn't do anything wrong. Not my fault. <laughs> All right. Why? Why don't you uh, read? Some of the people in the crowd, immediately on Eliza's side, told her not to worry to stop crying. The man with the little book stopped writing, stopped writing and came over to her. It's all right. It's all right. He said, nobody's hurting you, stupid girl. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you think I am? Her. What does he say to her? No, it's all right. It's all right. <laughs> then what does he call her? Stupid girl. Stupid. girl, you don't call yeah. someone stupid. That's that's, a, that's all right, you little dog or something. You stupid little girl. Who do you think I am? <laughs> all right, continue. I'm promise. I never said a word. Eliza cried. Oh, stop it! Stop it now! Do I look like a? Policeman, the man of in a quiet, friendly way. He said, oh, stop it, stop it now. Do I look like a policeman? <laughs> <laughs> he said it in a friendly way, though. All right. Um, would, would, Peter, would you read? Then what? Then why are you write, writing that all my work? She asked. How do you know what you wrote about me? You just show me what you wrote. The man opened his little book and held it. Held it? Held it. Uh, he held it under her nose. <laughs> what is it isn't real writing I can't read that it's not says but I can I, but I can the man answered and he started to read from his book pronouncing the words <laughs> pronouncing the words it's the same way 
Yes, it is a uh, for now this is vehicles some from access where he has the peace he knocked all my problem over and now he run away with us pray see but but why are you in this past of London? You come from this London, didn't you? Okay, let's stop here. So, he opens his little book and she says what? She says, how do I know what you've written down is true? And he said, well, I'll let you read it. So it goes like that. <laughs> what do you think? Do you think she can read? No. No, she doesn't know how to read. And he's, 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 he's taunting her, but at the same time, he's, he's telling her, he asks her, he said, what are you doing in this part of London? You don't belong here, do you? You belong from the west side of London. This is a real Covent Gardens with its theaters and its St. Saint, Saint Paul's Cathedral. It's very upper class. You don't come from this part, do you? You come from the West. Let's hear what she says. 